everyone welcome back to my channel today I have a grocery haul for you guys um, I just got my nails done real quick and stopped to get a nice coffee because when you're running errands on a Saturday it's kind of like disrespectful not to stop and get yourself a coffee right so I thought I would bring you guys along um, show you what I'm going to get for the week I have my um, dinner menu this week I'm having why does my notes never load? So stupid. I am having um, quesadillas, chicken quesadillas. I'm doing lamb chops. I'm doing um, Mediterranean bowls. And I'm doing a chicken stir fry. I have all the meat at home because I buy it in bulk at Costco. And just keep it in my freezer. So I just need a couple um, ingredients. Also, I'm doing these like uh, Mediterranean meatballs for my lunch. I haven't been good about meal prepping my lunch lately and I'm getting back on it because it's ridiculous. Um, it's A, a waste of money and B, nothing is healthier than home cooking. And I do not like the options around my work, um, don't really like the food at my work that much. So getting back on that grind. But I have a hard time with meal prepping as well because I don't like reheated chicken, it grosses me out and I don't want to eat beef every day. So. I'm gonna do Mediterranean meatballs for a couple days, two days. Then I'm going to do tuna sandwiches. I'm thinking if I should make a butternut squash soup. I've been wanting to do that. So maybe I'll pick up some butternut squash and do that with my tuna sandwich on the side. Kind of weird combo, but whatever. Anyways, let's go to the grocery store. Okay, so just left Whole Foods. I was feeling bougie today. I'm just playing, but um, yeah, I left Whole Foods. I just haven't been in so long. I'm like, let me go, because I just enjoy going to the grocery store because I'm like a grandma. Um, and that's like my kind of fun is going to the grocery stores and like Marshalls and stuff like that. But um, I'm going to go to Trader Joe's too because it's right across the street. And then I don't think I need anything at Kroger. But I um, just picked up a few things from Whole Foods. So let's go to Trader Joe's. So I just left Trader Joe's. I did not do any filming in there. It is so busy on a Saturday afternoon. I get so much anxiety in the grocery store when everyone is in my way. I'm trying to find things, look at things, and it's just chaotic. And this Trader Joe's is so tiny. It is so damn annoying. I miss being able to go on weekdays. But I'm about to head home and I will show you guys what I purchased. So I'm going to start off with what I got at Whole Foods. I just got some spring mix salad. I always like having um, spring mix in the fridge, throw together salads. It's an easy, easy thing to have. Um, then I got these Honeycrisp apples. Um, Honeycrisp is my absolute favorite type of apple. Really the only one I eat and I don't know why I got so many of them, but Oh my god, a couple things at Whole Foods. Then, um, I told you guys I was making Mediterranean meatballs and I needed squash and zucchini and bell peppers and all this stuff. And I was shopping around Whole Foods and I found the whole blend together. I'm like, oh my god, it's gonna make my life so much easier. And this was only like two dollars and something cents. I don't know exactly. So cheap. Um, so if you are on a budget, Get frozen vegetables. It's so much cheaper. It's a lot easier and quicker. So definitely recommend that. Um, so I was really excited to see that. Then I got some Vital Farm eggs. So yummy little eggs. And then I got two bags of the veggies. Um, and then I got a butternut squash. This thing's huge ginormous like wow it's heavy as hell but that's all i got from whole foods now let's move on to trader joe's i got a cucumber i always keep these in my house for my green smoothies in the morning and for salads and whatever um bananas I always have bananas in my house too uh, I got two bell peppers, green and red, for my quesadillas that I'm making. And then I got some Mexican cheese for my quesadillas as well. And then 
I got chickpeas for my triangles. Then I got some carrots to put um to make with my butternut squash soup. And then I got some mango chunks. I seen Fit Girl Mel, um, Kim Kardashian's trainer, if you don't know. She chopped these up and put them into her yogurt with like frozen grapes and like granola. I don't know, she made it look so delicious, so I'm like, I'm going to try that. So I got that. Then I got this um, fat-free feta cheese from Trader Joe's as well. And then I got this fettuccine, fettuccine Alfredo frozen. Um, I try not to eat pasta and like buy this type of stuff, but I do like to keep this on hand for in case of emergency if I get home from late really work or home late. Oh my god, I can't tell. Get home really late from work or if um, I forget to thought like meat in the morning or something like that. So these are always good just to have on hand. I love Trader Joe's ready meals. Then I got their chicken burgers. I don't know what video I mentioned it, but I was not lying when I say every single time I go to Trader Joe's, I always get a couple of chicken burgers to have on hand because they are the easiest, healthiest, well not healthiest, but like pretty healthy and great macros. So I love to keep these on hand at all times. So check these out if you've never tried them. So I didn't get too much stuff, honestly, this week. Um, like I said, I have all of my meat um, in the freezer, so that's why I don't really buy meat. But here's a little overview of everything that I got. So here is my fully stocked fridge. It doesn't really look like too much, but um, it's everything that I need to put together the meals that I'm making for the week. Hope you guys enjoyed this little mini grocery haul. I enjoyed filming this and do not forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video.